Hello everybody, I'm Gamester522 and welcome back to more Castlevania Symphony of the Night. We explored this little area up here, killed all rocks, and got the ability to echo with a as a bat. Lots of things. Luckily there's a warp over here I can just take. We just go straight there and explore that area, see where it takes us. Oh yeah, and we also learned how to do that. We now know how to wing smash. So now I, I, now I can go around and do this. Okay, that was me hitting spikes like a dumbass. Whee! We can get around places a whole lot faster now. At least horizontally, anyway. But I'm gonna go explore that dark area now. So that means I have to get to the underground caverns again. Okay, and I'm here. Screw you. So I just want to fall down. Alright. Yeah, screw you guys. Resist fire, sure. Why not? So I need to head up here now. Don't forget that some animals can live in complete darkness. Okay. Huh. All right. I'm pretty sure I did a lot more than just turn on the lights. Because now we can go this way. Uh, now give me this. Cross shuriken. Karma coin. Guess there's nothing over here. God, that's so cool. I don't, like do that all the time now. Wonder where I'm going. Spike breaker. And a library card. Okay, this spike breaker is an armor that I actually need. So, you got, and believe it or not, you guys know where that is, right? Okay, I think, would using a library card be faster? Nah, I probably don't want to waste it. Just head up here. Alright then. At least I can see where I'm going now. Oh yeah, I'm supposed to use the spike breaker armor, duh. Let's see if we put that on. See the spikes just break. Come on. 
I'm gonna go ahead and have this on in case I forget. Alright then. Now I need to go up. I don't know what I'm doing. Ow. Alright then, that worked out great. At least I went in there, got what I needed to. That's what makes this game so great. The fact that you don't even need to try and beat the game. Just explore and then beating it just comes naturally. That's what I love about this game. Exploring leads to you beating a game. It's, that's the kind of exploration I love the most. Okay, so I might as well take that warp. Uh, there's not really a close warp over there. Except for the one by the Colosseum, but that's probably the only one. Yeah, I think we'll have to go to the Colosseum warp and then just head back over there. So this is probably another fast forward because we've been through that area. We've been through this so many times that I don't need to explain it. So I'll see you guys in a minute. Actually, one thing I forgot, I'm actually going to come all the way back down here and go back into the clock room because we never took that up middle path and I actually want to now. Well, it's not that I want to now, it's just that I can. Huh. Ooh, items. Potion, hammer, life apple. Ooh, what is this? Gravity boots. Oh, yes. We can now do this. If you, put, if you do down, up, and then jump, you can leap straight up. This is... Okay. We have every single mobility tactic in this game now. Like, this shit goes high, as you can see. Like so. But yeah, I'm gonna stop bragging now. Okay, we have every single mobility perk in the game now, I believe. Well, at least that lets us explore, so to speak power of, I'm pretty sure that's like power of bad or something I'm not sure for miss I don't know yes yeah, I mean sure there are still a bunch of other things we're missing but you at least do shit we can at least like freaking jump stupid high in the air now screw you okay so I need, yeah, I need to head up. And I need to head this way. It's basically just I need to head straight, is all it is. Alright, fast forwarding. Okay, so I'm here now. Now I want to head up. There's also, yeah, there's also like a side over here I didn't get to explore yet. Okay, well, at least I got it. So if we come in here with our spark breaker on, we can do this.
But maybe you guys ask, what could be over here? So, did you find Richter? I don't know if he's the one you're looking for, but I found a Belmont. Really? So he is here? But the one I saw was the enemy. He was the lord of this castle. That, that can't be true. You're wrong. I, I, I must go now. All right. And here we get a silver ring. This is one of the two key crucial items we need. Oh yeah, so does anything happen if I sit here? What about over here? No? Okay. Okay, so yeah, the spike breaker armor took us in there and we got one of the most crucial items in the entire game. Now then. I'm trying to think. Actually, yeah, I didn't explore that. I didn't explore that over there. Like, yeah, the, like that long drop down that takes you to the underground cavern, there's a doorway right there and I didn't go there yet. So you guys know where I'm going next. So fast forward in time. Okay, so I made it back where the drop is. So now we want to head down to it. Because now, we can fly. Now, where does this lead? Claymore. Did I get a new sword, a better sword? You know, I could probably live with this, maybe. It's a big ass sword. And in the air, it kind of goes kind of fast, so I guess it's probably a good thing. What the fuck is even over here? Ooh. Meal ticket, meal ticket. Moonstone. Did I actually get an accessory I can equip now? Improve stats after sunset. Well, it is nighttime right now, so... Fuck yeah. Okay, so here's a save room. I'm gonna hit this up. I think I know where I am now. Okay, yep, I was right. So this looks like a save room, right? So let's go ahead and do it. Nightmare. Mother! That voice! Alucard, it's you! I'm coming, Mother! I'll save you! No, Alucard! Don't come here! But, Mother! It's all right. If my death can save others, I gladly surrender my life. Mother, no! Please, no! Yes, Alucard. Watch me die, and remember always my last words to you. Yes, Mother. You must despise humans. They are to be your prey. What? Better for them to die than to let them compound their sins. 
begin by slaying that one over there. No, it wasn't like this. What's wrong? Alucard. My mother never said such a thing. What do you mean? Kill them and bring them happiness. No, you're not my mother. What kind of demon are you? <laughs> you broke free of my spell. I like that. Demon, death is too good for you. Come here, little boy, and show me what you've got. All right. So now we get to fight Succubus. Oh, shit. Okay, well, I found the real one, at least. Ow. Darkling, I smell your blood. You're a vampire? Could it be... That strength, that beauty. You're the son of Lord Dracula. Death in the dream world will set your soul wandering for eternity, demon. Wait! I beg of you! And by doing that, we get the gold ring. We now have the silver ring and the gold ring. We need both of these items. They are extremely crucial. But damn, this claymore is really good. Not to mention I have moonstone. It's dark outside. I think it actually does work based off your in yeah, the clock you have set. Probably. At least that's how I think it is. So my stats are kind of stupid right now. Not to mention this claymore is pretty good. I love the reach on it. Okay, that's not what I meant to do. That was by accident. Uh, okay, so what else have I not checked yet? Yeah, it looks like... It literally looks like the clock tower is the only place. So we get to head to the clock tower and then the... The top floor. So, yes. Getting a lot done right now. It's actually really badass. Okay, um... Looks like my quickest way is to go over that way and take the warp over there, maybe. Yeah, let's just do that. Alright, fast forwarding to the clock tower! Alright boys, so we're at the clock tower now. We can finally explore this place. I feel like we've done everything else here except this. Okay, well first off, let's head up. Alright. So we got a doorway right over here. Ooh! Fire of Bat. What does that do? Shoot fireballs as Bat. Oh, okay, that's cool. Sweet. Alright. So I'm just gonna do this, kind of like fill up the map. We'll explore down there, don't worry. Okay, so over here... Okay, that's the clock tower itself. I don't want to go in there yet. Okay, so now I just got one little square over here. There we go. Let's fall down a bit. Crap, there's items up there. Oh, shit. Shaman shield. 
Is that just like shaman equipment that I just picked up? Just like random crap? All these bridges are falling. Bitch, don't want none! Okay, then. Actually, hold on. Too fast, too fast. Small little spot I missed right here. Yeah, there we go. Now, there is a bit of a puzzle gimmick here in this place. But I have to get to it first. Duh. Okay, but yeah. You see these gears right here? We want to hit those. Yeah, we want to hit them until we hear a clicking noise. Just gotta make sure I'm not missing any of them. Okay, see that one clicked. That first, okay, that first one up there clicked. That one, second one clicked. Um, okay, now I want to come over here, and we need to click these. Okay. Now I think there's one more gear left. Yeah, right here. Okay, that clicked. All right. And this door over here opens up. Steel Helm, Gold Mail, and Star Flail. So let's take a look at this. Gold Plate, Gold Breastplate. God, that's just shitty. Star Flail. Hmm. Flail with Spark Balls. You know, probably would have been good. Assuming, of course, I didn't already get freaking good stuff okay then um next we head up now I think that wall right here is breakable actually ow bitch off this wall. yeah see like she even said so she told me something for once so yay fuck you get the f Freaking stupid Fleeman. Okay, let's see here. Alright then. Beauty! Oh, you're dead. Okay, so there's a life up right here. Make sure I jump over here so I can complete the map. There's a heart up right here. So yeah, bingo. Yahtzee. More stuff. And things. I swear to god. I'm so unoriginal, it hurts. Get off. Me alone, you pieces of crap. Okay, I'm just gonna go. I'm not even gonna bother with you guys. I'm gonna continue going. I'm gonna see what's over here. Apparently a weak ass motherfucker. Uh, let's see. I can head up. Iframes, buddy. Okay, so. Looks like I can kind of just maybe just bat my way through over here. There's a dead end right there, so that means I do have to drop back down. So it looks like they it looks like they become Alistairs once they die. You know, I wouldn't have to worry about platforming if I didn't already have the ability to fucking fly. Um okay, actually there's something down here, apparently. Getting map. 
Well, that should have been obvious. Healing mail. The hell does that do? Uh, healing mail. Restore HP while walking. You know, that's actually not bad. I'll probably use that from time to time, I bet. Okay, what the fuck? I just hit a wall, apparently. Oh, hello, Silphus. Or Kurosamasu, whatever the fuck you're called. Bitch, you have no idea how powerful I am right now. So that's what I thought. See, I didn't even gain a level. That's how strong I am. But yeah, where does this take us? I'm going to assume it takes us to the final area. Yep, the top floor. So I'm just going to hit up a save room, probably. Look how epic this is. It's just letting you know, even though I could have just flown up here and did that, but whatever. Okay, so here's a save room, but I'm going to have to end this video off here. But, you guys know what the next part means. The end of the game. Or is it? Till then, see you then.